We are back in Studio A thanks to DTE. They put in a lot of hard work and had people come in from out of state and got us back home, man. I appreciate all the hard work they put in. And thanks to mom as well for opening up her home to me and my family and also known as Studio B. Thank you, mom, and I love you. So this here is going to be something you guys, I've gotten comments from all over thinking that this is not going to happen as far as the Detroit Lions trading for Jalen Ramsey, but coming from Tom Pelissero, shout out to my guy, Mr. Poole, always make sure I'm up on everything Detroit Lions and also everything NFL. I saw this as I was coming back from Studio B, a.k.a. Mom's House, saying that Jalen Ramsey, this is from Tom Pelissero, the Rams have had trade talks about six-time Pro Bowl cornerback Jalen Ramsey, and league sources now believe it's very likely Ramsey is dealt in the coming weeks. Ramsey, 28 is due seventeen million in twenty twenty three on a front loaded deal that averages twenty million, and L A is clearing cap space. L A cut Bobby Wagner yesterday, and I'm telling you what, man, I guarantee you that Brad Holmes is looking into this. Brad Holmes, the Detroit Lions, are one of the teams that is looking into Jalen Ramsey. Also, when it comes to Bobby Wagner. Now, I want you to think about this. Bobby Wagner was cut Thursday morning. Thursday evening, they announced that Michael Brockers was going to be released Friday, which was today. We all knew that was coming. We expect three more roster cuts, a minimum of two, possibly three. The only one I think is truly on the fence is Romeo. Romeo Aquara, he's on the fence. Big V and Charles Harris, I believe, are going to be gone. That's going to clear up almost $20 million in cap space between Brockers, Vitae, and Harris. That is no coincidences. One thing that I learned in dealing with life and YouTube is that a coincidence is a rare occasion. We use the word coincidence a lot in life, but we don't understand and appreciate how rare a coincidence is. Now, I'm not saying that that move was made to sign Bobby Wagner. I'm not saying it was made to sign Jalen Ramsey. But I am almost certain, I have no inside information, but I am almost certain that Jalen Ramsey is definitely on the Detroit Lions radar. I know a lot of y'all don't want to hear it. I have seen videos. I have heard people in the comment section saying that Jalen Ramsey is not going to be a Detroit Lion. Now, you... Those people are likely more right than I. You have a 1 in 31 chance that you're going to write, be right. I have like a 31 in 1 chance that I'm going to be right. I just truly feel that Jalen Ramsey is on the radar of the Detroit Lions. Brad Holmes had dealings with him. We worry about his character. We talk about his character. And that was my main concern from the very beginning. Jalen Ramsey's character. Would it fit in what we're trying to do? I believe that if anybody can get Jalen Ramsey composed, it would be Dan Campbell and Brad Holmes. Brad Holmes has that connection from L.A., and Dan Campbell is the guy that people are wanting to play for. He's a player's coach, and we've heard everybody talk about it. So will this happen? You're more likely right than I am. But if I'm right about this, I definitely will not hesitate to kind of shove it in people's faces because I think that it's a real possibility that the Detroit Lions are looking. Jalen Ramsey, at 29 years old, is still a force. His salary cap is something that the Detroit Lions would have to worry about. However, there might be a way that Dan, Cam- Dan Campbell and Brad Holmes could get L.A., to maybe do something with it as far as or when he comes to Detroit, he's going to restructure. Jalen Ramsey is an L.A. Ram for, I want to say, two or three more years. I think he's through 2025, so it would be this season because he signed a monster deal, $100 million for five years, I think two seasons ago. So he's on, but but as Tom Pelissero said, it was front-loaded. It, the deal was really, really heavy in the first two years. It starts to loosen up this year on. But I believe that your Detroit Lions, that Jalen Ramsey is a real possibility. And don't be surprised 
if it happens. Now, again, it may not happen. You're more likely to be right. It's like playing the lottery. (laughs) You have a better chance to be right than I do. But I really believe that not only Jalen Ramsey, but Bobby Wagner. I think that Bobby Wagner and Jalen Ramsey are more of a possibility than free agent Robert Woods because our defense is in dire need of some help. We just extended Aaron Glenn, or we will extend him. And these are two players who have been in the league, are veterans in the league, and are still difference makers. Bobby Wagner at 32 years old, Jalen Ramsey at 29. Now, I don't think we get both these guys, but I think we're going to get one or the other, and I just would not be surprised. Don't Do not write this off. Don't write off that Jalen Ramsey will be a Detroit Lion. I'm, I'm just saying. The connection is there. Jared Goff, I'm on Ross St. Brown with the call out, yapping it up at the Pro Bowl. Do not be surprised. And now this tweet from Tom Pelissero just an hour ago confirms the rumors that we've been hearing for the last month that Jalen Ramsey is most likely going to be dealt. So keep an ear close to the ground and expect a trade for uh, that Jalen Ramsey will be dealt. And I I think your Detroit Lions have a real good chance to land him. But let me know in the comments below. We seem to be a bit divided on Jalen Ramsey, whether you want him or not. Let me know because you know how I feel. I would love to have him part of this team. But my name is Derek. This is Detroit Lions Syndicate again. Thank you, Mom, for opening up your home. Thank you, all the men, women, out-of-state workers that came in uh, and to help the 500-plus thousand people that are out of power, and they still got a lot of work to do. And I really appreciate those being out there in the weather, those men and women who put in that work. They worked 24 hours to get us back, and we were only out of power for about... 36 hours. So I appreciate that. You guys are awesome. Take care of yourself. And as always, go Lions. And do not be surprised. If Listen, if Jalen, either way it go, if Jalen Ramsey is a Detroit Lion, I want everybody who doesn't believe it, come back and say, Derek, you were right.